Welcome back to Introduction to Engineering Design. Today what we're going to talk about is uh, how we can attach information inside of our part files uh, that will be used later on in our modeling in our drawings. So to do this what we want to do is we want to come up here and click on the tab uh, that as we hover over it it will say File Properties. So it's right where my mouse is flashing. And I click on that tab to open it. And it may open up here to the summary information. Uh, you can type things in here and use those later on, though we're going to focus on the Custom tab. So click on that middle Custom tab. I've uh, played with this a little bit before, so yours may be blank. I've got a few things in here. Uh, but the very first drop-down, and if I click on the drop-down arrow, you'll see Description. And what I want to do is I want to type in a description for this part. And because it's part of the Puzzle Cube, I'm going to call it the Puzzle Cube Brown Part. And we're going to use that as the title for our drawing. You'll see how we'll do that as we move into our drawings. So that's how we enter summary information. There's a lot of other summary information, and you can see that I could type in many different things in here. And it's contained as information attached to the part that can be used by any subsequent assembly or drawing. So what I'll want you to do is I'll want you to type that in, click on OK, and then save your part, and you'll want to do that for all five of your Puzzle Cube pieces. I hope that helps. Thanks for watching.